Hello, everyone. Uh, I have a word from God. Um, it's actually just a little while ago. It's October 30th, 2022. And um, I was really impressed to get this out right away. So here we go. The title of this, and he gave me the title, The Time, the time of Change is Upon You. And remember, this is all downloads I get from Father God. This is what he tells me. Um, this is what I hear uh, come into my head. And um, I, especially when I start seeking him and praising him and, and just following him and getting into his word. And then all of a sudden he just kind of says, it's time. It's time to get the prophecy out. It's time to get the words out. And so uh, and then I just, I, I get everything out of my head. And I only focus on him. And then he downloads it into my head, and then I start writing it down. So that's what I do. Um, this word is October 30th, 2022, and uh, it is called, The Time of Change is Upon You. Okay. For I, the Lord, know the change is coming to you, my children. The changes are swiftly coming. Wait and watch, my children, as you see each world leader step down and release, and release themselves from the control they had over you. I, the Father God, had this all in control. Freedom is coming to you faster than you realize. A freedom from this system that was put in place to control and manipulate you. Yes, the control and manipulation manipulation is deep and set in your current system of economy right down to the way you think it should be when in all okay I'll, I'll get this right when in all actuality it was never to be put in place in the first place the current system yes the Babylonian system was never to be for you my children I wanted a system that represented heaven and a culture like it in heaven you have every with you have everything you need so it was supposed to be here on earth everything is everything he keeps saying that to me this was to be my design and operation of the example it is in heaven and just like uh, it says like my prayer that jesus gave to you on earth that is in heaven so let me get that right on earth that it is in heaven you shall see you shall see a turning of events that bring about changes and new beginnings the events that shake the people of the earth to its core i god the father am able and willing to do this don't be asleep and not ready for this change for this time of change. O oh, believers of the church, wake up. Let go of the man-made doctrines and religion that, have, that enslave you. Don't you see that I cannot show up when you don't freely worship me? I, the Father, have a limited window of time left for you to let go of these ideas and doctrines that make you a slave to it. Can you see that my signs, wonder, wonders, and miracles do not show up in your churches for a reason? If you do not change soon, I will be forced to leave you behind. Remember in my word, you will either be hot or cold, not on the fence. You have to choose. It is either me, the Father God, or not me. The other choice is from a view of man, the one that represents the devil. Yes, children, you have a choice. Make it soon. And I, I'm feeling that. I, I am really feeling that's really, we're very close. And then he said, um, there is darkness coming soon to those who tried to take over my earth and bring a one world government without me in it. They are all used by the devil, if they wanted to admit it or not. I still have to give them a choice. 
keep watching my children, you will see the evil elite either step down or be removed. I will finish what I started. There will come a day, like the days of Noah, when the people will be too late to change, for the door will be closed like the door on Noah's ark. They all died. This will be soon. I, the Father God, have a time when I will visit those that need me and serve me. Like the day of Passover, I will keep you locked in while I take out all of those who serve the evil one world government. This will come to pass. Observe and obey the lock-in in your homes, for I will finish the takedown of the evil rulers in your present day. Yes, this is a real event coming. I will protect you, my children. During this time, look only to me and spend time with me. Pray and praise me so I can protect and inhabit you. This is for all who believe in me and want me, your Father God. I want you to know this change is for your benefit. The benefits like freedom you've never experienced before. Most of you had no idea you were under slavery. Yes, slavery to break. Let me get that right. Yes, slavery to buy and sell with taxes and interest rates. A slave to how much your earnings were cut from you in one way or another. You will be able to live freely for me and with me. All the dreams, and so this is what he's, he's saying now um, when you're not being a slave. You will be able to live freely for me and with me. All the dreams you had and all the guidance from me will be opened up for you to do and experience. The days ahead are full of heavenly health, wealth, and prosperity. These are my days of fulfillment of the kingdom era I will have for you. It will be like a dream. You will have days of a past way of living, and then the next days that are totally different. I will wipe out the evil like it never existed. The current modern day evil pharaohs will be gone like dust. It will be wiped away. Prepare yourselves now to live in my future of a heavenly place now. Live like you are in the future, already living for me in all ways. I will not fail you, my precious believers. Be the true believers that only serve me and no other things that are in place of me. It is more important than me. Sorry, I'm going to get that right. If it is more important than me, then surrender it and let go of it. Ask me if you need any kind of help. I will do it. My children, I love you. Do not wait any longer. I have to change the world for your benefit. The earth and my children cry out for help and change. I want all of you to choose me and my son Jesus Christ. Not all is lost. It just looks like it. Believe, believe in me and my son. Uh, hold on a second. Belief in me and my son can turn it all around for you. No one will be lost. My son Jesus Christ died on the cross for all of your sins and made a way for you to live in a life filled with me. His blood was shed for you. Anything that you did is forgiven. Just acknowledge Jesus and ask him into your life. Ask him for forgiveness for we all fall short living in this life of sin. Once you do this and repent, Jesus will wash away anything that was broken and not from him. It is all gone. Your new life starts right away. And now you are free to serve 
Jesus, and me, God the Father. I will send my Holy Spirit to guide you. And yes, he will. You will learn to hear him, and he will be your comforter. Get into my word and praise me. Worship me. I will show up. Expect me to fill you up with everything you need. I, the Father God, know all and see all. Nothing gets past me. Remember me in all things. Include me in every part of your life. I won't let you down. I love you, your Father God. Well, thank you for... Uh, Thank you for letting me share this word with you. This is from the Father God, and I wanted to get it out right away. Um, go ahead and share this with everyone, uh, and then I will see you next time. Uh, thank you for letting me do this. Thank you. Bye.